gonna show you how to get up on that building right there. And the way you're gonna do this is you're gonna get a rocket. So you can go rocket strafe it. And you can go up this way for a faster way. And then you run and jump. And then from here, you wanna either strafe or rocket all the way to that sign right there. Okay, now I'm gonna strafe there. So you back up a little. And then you run and straight, just like I did right here. Okay, now the easier way. Now you rock it over there. What you do is you rock it and then strafe and jump. So, here we go. Just like this. And you want to make sure you have three rockets to begin with, because you're going to need two rockets for this next part I'm going to show you after this. So you get over here, just like I showed you before. Okay, in order to get up here, you're gonna need to go over this edge, and there's like a little space where you can like go back and forth. You're gonna have to jump around that onto this invisible barrier right here, like this. And you can just jump up. And normally people run and jump and just hit that and bounce off and hit them, so it's a really difficult one. And then from here, you can jump over to here if you want. Get up on the sign. Make sure you have two rockets for this though. You run and jump to that pole. And then you get up on here and then you uh, crouch. Back up until you like kind of just dip down. Okay? And then just go up a little more. Pull out your rocket. Straight down. And rock and jump. Like this. And then once you're up here, you can just uh, to get up on there, you just stand right beside this, and then rock it down, and then jump up. Okay, and then from here, you can just uh, rock it back and jump like this. And the only way to get back in the map is if you go over that way. Just jump down. You can also get to this building right here. And I think you might be able to just jump it straight, but to be safe, I'm gonna strafe it. Walk around here, not, not really much to do. And you can't get over here, there's a barrier. But you can go down here and tease people. Say, haha, you can't get me or something. And then jump back up here. And that's basically it. Okay, as I was saying, on the previous building, you can get up two ways. This is the second way. Get up on the second story, get up in the washer, in the red part, back up and jump. And the same thing right here. Jump. Over this one. Here, you're gonna want to uh, 
jump up on this side of the fence. If you hit the fence or on the other side, you fall over. But look. And then from here, you jump right over here. You're outside of the map. You can get back on the barriers by jumping on it. Good. Okay, I'm gonna show you another way or another glitch to get uh, from up here. There's an invisible barrier right in front of Mr. Beast. What you do, you jump on his head and jump up on the barrier. You need to do that, or I'm gonna show you right now. Okay, to get up on this barrier, you're one person. Jump over to where Mr. Beast is, and then you rock and jump up on it. showing you, you can get over to this barrier by going over here, turning and jumping, make sure you have a rock though, and rock it yourself up like this. You can basically go anywhere, you don't fall down right here. First of all, I'm going to show you how to get up here. You start down here, in this building right here. You just crawl over this wall, jump up on this ledge, and go up on this window, uh, like right here. You jump over to this, up on this uh, little roof thing that sticks out. From here, you run and jump where Mr. Beast is, but you got to be careful. There's like a small invisible barrier. Because if you see where I'm aiming right now, there's like a little white line and it just follows it all the way out. Okay, now, um, now you just run and jump to the barrier. And then you can either walk along it or just jump over it. So, here we go. And to get up on the bridge, you just follow my lead. I get up on this uh, wire right, or this pole right here, and I just walk over. So if you walk on those black lines right there, it's so much easier to fall. Here you actually have a little ways to uh, go to each side, so and then you can just like jump down in here. 